On the latest episode of WWE SmackDown, tensions reached a boiling point between Roman Reigns and the Bloodline. Although Reigns hinted at acknowledging Solo Sikoa during the main event, he stopped short of recognizing his cousin as the true tribal chief. This led to a dramatic turn of events, where Reigns was left at the mercy of the Bloodline, receiving multiple Samoan spikes in the process. The night began with Reigns addressing the crowd, declaring that this might be the last time they would acknowledge him. However, the situation took a turn when Sokoa interrupted, referencing a conversation he had earlier with Jey Uso. Reigns expressed doubt that the bloodline was truly united and acknowledged the struggles they'd faced over the past year. Hoping to mend the family's bonds, Reigns asked what it would take to repair the damage. Sokoa's response was simple. Reigns needed to acknowledge him. While Reigns did recognize Sokoa, he hesitated when it came to addressing him as the tribal chief. This moment of defiance caused tension to erupt, with Sokoa calling in backup. The bloodline appeared dragging out a beaten Jimmy Uso, which served as a distraction for Sokoa to attempt a Samoan spike. Reigns fought off the attack, but ultimately fell victim to a vicious assault. Held down by the Tongans, Reigns endured multiple Samoan spikes as the show ended, leaving the bloodline standing tall over their fallen leader.